Michelle and I'm an intern here at the Dutch Consulate. This is actually the third time I came to this city. The first time I came here was for my studies and then I loved it so much that I decided to come back. In the previous two films we have introduced our staff and explained what our tasks and services exactly are. This film will not be us giving you information but in fact it will be visa applicants telling you about our consular services and companies talking about the interactions they have with us. We will end with some exciting news which you don't want to miss so make sure you stay tuned. I am Narendra Kocha and I started this company Kiran Hydraulic Needs Private Limited 29 years ago. The Dutch Consulate has an extended arm which is the NBSOs and working with them has been a tremendous experience because they've created substantial business value. One particular experience with the Chennai NBSO has been to get introduced to a company called Bolograph through which we've purchased waste processing equipment for solid garbage. The Dutch Consulate in Mumbai introduced us to Rabobank and they facilitated the financing of this project. Hi, my name is Steven. I'm uh, responsible for the Trading Commodity Finance Desk here in Rabobank in India. Hi, my name is Gurvinder. I'm responsible for the International Desk. The International Desk is there to serve our Dutch client base in India. Our relationship with the Dutch Consulate is quite intensive. I think especially in the food and agri space, whenever there is a Dutch mission coming from the Netherlands, we try to share our knowledge with the Dutch consulate and set up a program with them. This is Deepika. Uh, I'm traveling to Netherlands through Infosys. I have applied for my work permit visa. Hi, my name is Rajiv Gurg and I've applied for Netherlands work visa. Hi, this is Suleta. I have applied for Netherlands work permit for a year. I'm really excited to go there. This will be my second visit to Netherlands. The entire process of uh, visa is really, really easy, except maybe Legalization of birth certificate which requires you to go to Delhi, get it uh, verified by the RTO and then the EMEA has to stamp it and say that yes, you are legally born. Hi, I am Dilip Podar, founder and chairman of DK Corporation. Hi, I am uh, Gaurav Podar, vice president at DK Corporation. The core business of our company is to bring about new products into the Indian energy sector and we represent companies from all over the world. Our association with the Dutch Consulate I think dates back to 1995 when we had a chance to meet Mr. Bansal and very recently he has introduced us to INBA. The Dutch Consulate is also very instrumental in part of growing our business not only with existing companies, but also with new business development. So that sums up all the opinions we have been receiving. Now here's for the exciting news I promised you earlier. The Dutch consulate has always had Dutch interns working here, but now we're opening our doors to an Indian intern. Being an intern at the Dutch consulate offers you an opportunity so unique that you can significantly expand your network. You'll be attending formal conferences and informal drinks and also meet with CEOs personally. Your tasks will vary from updating our social media to organizing conferences and even the upcoming Dutch Weeks. For more information on how to become the next intern at our consulate, keep checking our Facebook page. <laughs>